Show. Ah, bubbles. Is there any sight more magical than that of a bubble floating gracefully through the air? Most of the Mr. Men and Little Misses take great delight in bubbles, whether in their garden or in the bath. No one loves relaxing in a bath full of bubbles more than Mr. Quiet. Bye-bye. Bubbles. Having a bath! So I thought, I wonder if Mr. Quiet knows that his kitty is outside. Maybe I should catch him. So I said, here, kitty, kitty, and he came. I have a way with animals, even mice. It's OK. Here he is. He uses the cat flap. Unless your cat goes outside through a cat flap, that's a different story. Oh, you do have a cat flap. I wonder if I should get one of those for my parrot, Featherbrain. She's really smart. I'm sure she could learn to use it. Yeah, 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 good idea. I think I'll go down to the pet shop right now. Oh, here's your kitty. Thank you. Goodbye. So long. Now, Knock! Just as I thought, Mr. Nosy, he is at home. I have this parcel for you and didn't want to leave it on the doorstep. Besides, then I wouldn't get to see what's inside. <laughs> you do love a good parcel, don't you, Nose? Certainly do, Mr. Small. Hello again, Mr. Quiet. I just wanted to make sure I fitted through a cat flap in case I needed to show Featherbrain how to go through one. Wait, what's going on? Are you having a party? Did someone say party? I love a party. Mr. Quiet is about to open his parcel. <gasps> Rubber ducky! That's something you don't see every day. Hmm. Not in a great big parcel anyway. Speaking of parcels, we have lots more to deliver. Right behind you, buddy boy. This room is a See ya! Sorry to go, Mr. Quiet, but that really wasn't much of a party. There wasn't even any food. Hey, that rubber ducky would be perfect to take in a bubble bath. Oh, don't you love a nice relaxing bubble bath? I know I do. Ah, oh, bubbles. Here in Dillydale, not every bath you take is in water as Mr. Messy's friends are soon going to find out. I hope you're all going to like this place. We're going to spend a day with nature. A lovely walk by a babbling brook. Talk about scary! No, the Dilly Dale mud baths! Did, did you say? He did! Ha <laughs> ha! There's no such thing as a mud bath! Miss Scary is correct. Mud and bath do not go together. Hello! <laughs> and welcome to the Dilly Dale Mud Bath! Hey, Mr. Happy! My friends are sort of nervous about the mud baths. Whoa! -ho -ho! First timers! You're in for a real treat! <laughs> Follow me! You don't honestly expect us to go in there, do you? Of course! What we recommend is slowly easing yourself into the warm, bubbling pools of mud right up to your neck. Don't need to ask me twice. Ooh. Oh, how absolutely revolting. Come on in. It's nice and squishy. Plus, the mud makes bubbles. Oh, I thought it would be molten hot, but it's pleasingly warm. Why not? My 
maybe there's something scary underneath all that mud. <laughs> Sweet apple strudel, have you all lost your mind? Come on, Mr. Fussy, try it. I cannot imagine anything more disgusting than being buried up to your neck in filthy mud. Oh, I'm pretty sure this is clean mud. <laughs> Mr. Messy, I uh, can't quite believe I'm saying this, but this mud bath is almost pleasant. Told you. How about the soothing eye masks to get the full relaxing experience? <laughs> oh, I have never felt so warm and relaxed. <laughs> no, 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 no! Menacing mud monster! Bubbling baths of water! <laughs> oh, really, Mr. Messy, pipe down with all your noise. Go away, you muddy monster of murky menace! Where did they all go? <sighs> Some people just don't know how to relax. <laughs> And do we have a fantastic show for you? It's Inventions Day once again here on Good Morning Dillydale. We'll be seeing two brand new inventions. I wish someone would invent a hair ribbon that won't crumple. Ha <laughs> ha! Now that would be useful. Let's meet our inventors, Miss Whoops and Mr. Grumpy. Let's start with you, Miss Whoops. What invention would you like to share with us today? Hmm? I call it the Bubble Bicycle. On account of this. <gasps> I love bubbles. I love them, bubbles, love them. Oh! Who doesn't? And the more you pedal, the more bubbles come out. What a wonderful invention. <laughs> Think of the joy this will bring to others. <laughs> OK. Enough with these cockamamie bubbles. Let's get this show moving. Oh, I almost forgot. We have Mr. Grumpy and his invention, too. Show us your stuff, Mr. Grumpy. I've invented a fishing rod guaranteed to find a fish. Does it blow bubbles, too? No bubbles. It has a built-in video monitor, which tells you when a fish is nearby. <laughs> Wonderful! But does it bring joy to others? Like Miss Whoops's bubble bicycle, huh? No. I mean, yes, it brings lots of joy. To me. Just watch. I put a fish in a bucket somewhere in this studio and this baby's gonna find it. When it finds the fish, then does it blow bubbles? There are no bubbles involved. Wait a minute. I'm getting something... Miss Whoops, are those bubbles cherry scented? Guess again. <gasps> Strawberry! No, wait, grape! Oh, I give up! Now I'll just cast my reel. I know, the pineapple scented. With a touch of mango. Mango schmango, forget about the bubbles and watch me catch my fish. Certainly, Mr. Grumpy. You go right ahead. <laughs> <laughs> It's a blizzard of bubbles. <laughs> I've caught the fish. Out of my way, everyone. Out of my way. Oh. That fish looks just like Mr. Scatterbrain. Or I look just like the fish. <laughs> oh, crooked cucumbers. My invention would have worked perfectly if it hadn't been for those bubbles and this nitwit. <laughs> Ooh, I love bubbles. <laughs> 
Oh, for noodles sake, get me out of here. I'm afraid we're out of time. I'm Mr. Happy. And I'm Miss Sunshine. And I'm stuck in a bubble, so someone do something. Me, hey, I'm Mr. Grumpy. Wonderful. <laughs> Join us tomorrow for Good Morning Dino. <laughs> and so, you see, there are many different kinds of bubbles to enjoy in Dillydale. So whether you're a fan of the bubble bath or the bubble bike, a bubble is guaranteed to bring a smile. Ooh.